So to calculate the yellow change interval, we can use this equation. So we're solving for that calculated yellow time. And we're going to start with our reaction time. And that's typically one second, unless you have other information. And we're going to add to that the design speed in feet per second divided by 2 times the deceleration rate, which is typically 10 feet per second. Some agent, 10 feet per second squared. Some agencies use 11.2 feet per second squared. Some may use something other than that, but we can assume 10 feet per second squared if there's no other information provided. And then we're going to add to that 2 times the grade of the approach times the acceleration due to gravity. Looking at an example, we're asked to find this yellow change interval for the approach to a traffic signal on a roadway with a 45 mile per hour design speed and a 3% downgrade. So plugging in our values for our equation, y equals one second, plus on the numerator, 45 miles per hour, times our conversion to convert that to feet per second. So that's 1.467 times our 45 miles per hour. In our denominator, 2 times our deceleration of 10 feet per second squared plus 2 times negative 0 0.03 times 32.2 feet per second squared. And we're going to simplify the, the uh, fraction part of this, so it's going to be 3.65 seconds plus the one second that we started with with our reaction time. So our yellow change interval is 4.65 seconds, and that is answer D.